polycystic ovarian syndrome what are its symptoms causes how it is diagnosed and treated hello and welcome to mini medicos polycystic ovarian syndrome is the most common hormonal disorder in females of reproductive age group and is more common in obese females pathophysiology of pcod there is excessive androgen production from the ovaries this androgen is then converted to estrogen by a hormone called aromatase increased estrogen level will cause three things it causes negative feedback on fsh so decrease the level of fsh it causes positive feedback on luteinizing hormone so luteinizing hormone increases it also increase the chances of endometrial hyperplasia and endometrial carcinoma breast and ovarian carcinoma due to increased level of luteinizing hormone in the early phase of cycle lh surge will not occur so it cause an ovulation which result in infertility and absence of corpus luteum when corpus luteum is absent progesterone will be absent an ovulation also called multiple follicles that appear like cyst in the periphery of the ovary increase lh also cause thicker thickal cell hyperplasia that increase the androgen production insulin resistance manifest as an acanthosis nigricans you can see it is hyperpigmentation of skin in axilla and nape of neck serum insulin level will be about 25 international unit diagnosis of pcos is made by rotendam criteria that state any two of the following should be present to diagnose pcod hyperandrogenism it manifest as hirsutism what is hirsutism it is male pattern hair growth on a woman's face chest and back ovulatory dysfunction amenorrhea irregular cycles usg evidence of pcos are more than 12 follicles in one or both ovaries follicle should be less than 10 mm and volume of ovary should be greater than 10 cc obesity is not a criteria and it is more common in reproductive age group you can see usg image of pcos complications of pcos are short term complication that include infertility hirsutism irregular cycles long term complications are heart disease endometrial cancer breast cancer ovarian cancer and diabetes mellitus treatment of pcos insulin resistance for insulin resistance we give metformin for irregular cycle drug of choice is oral contraceptive pills and for hirsutism also the drug of choice is oral contraceptive pills treatment of infertility first line drugs drug of choice is letrozole other drugs are clomiphene citrate and bromocriptine second line treatment here we give human menopausal gonadotropins and also laparoscopic ovarian drilling is done third line treatment in it we give synthetic gonadotropin releasing hormone in pulsatile manner side effects of ovulation induction are multiple pregnancies it is most common ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome menopause like symptoms laparoscopic drilling drilling here no risk of multiple pregnancies but risk of premature ovarian failure is present in ovarian drilling thanks for watching this video please like and subscribe mini medicos for more videos like this